Hello everyone and welcome to your tarot reading for the 14th of July through to the 20th of July. And today I thought we would use the art through the eyes of the soul on the test. And as usual we'll shuffle the cards and pick one card for each day of the week from Monday the 14th through to Sunday the 20th of July. Okay, so let's start. On Monday, what's the card from Monday? Monday's card is a visualized feeling. So if you haven't been well, do a visualization. So you visualize your own feeling. You visualize yourself getting well. You visualize very specifically the way you look and the way you feel when you're well. And that will help you. So visualize feeling. Okay, that's from Monday. The Tuesday, let's get this card for Tuesday. Okay. From Tuesday we have Magic is Alive, Ask Your Divine Child. Okay, this means magic is alive within you and within the world. And so for Tuesday, don't forget to see the magic in yourself and the magic in the world. If you feel like you've lost the magic in yourself, ask your child within you. And ask them to show you how to bring that magic back out into the world that you used to connect with so well. Okay, so that's the Tuesday. Connect with your inner child. Connect with the joy of the magic that your inner child brings to yourself and the world. Okay, let's go for Wednesday's card. Wednesday's card tells me you've been having a hard time lately. And this is about arriving from the ashes of the day. So you're having a very hard time lately. But don't worry, you can arrive from from this place of despair and good things are gonna to come to you. So don't worry about it. And just try and bring your teeth and bear what you're going through now because it'll actually all culminate in something wonderful and good things are coming your way. So that's going to take time. Let's look at a card for Thursday. Thursday's card is bring peace to trouble for Okay, first of all, is that if you're having hard um, problems and things, peace will come, but also if you have an argument in that, you need to find a way to break your peace. You need to be the peace bringer. Like, you know, sometimes it's better to just go, okay, you know, you win. It's not about letting people stand on you or giving in, but it's just saying, you know, we can agree to disagree on this point. You don't have to keep on arguing. Okay, so that's first thing. Friday show. Okay, it says there are a lot of shifts happening on Friday in your energy field. Then make sure you stabilize your energy field. So that could be through grounding or having a healing, like a crystal healing or Reiki healing. So, you know, find a way to stabilize your energy because there's lots of shifts going on, on in your life. So on Friday, find a way to stabilize your energy. Okay, then we have Saturday's card. Let's see, we have Seek the Guide, Give Noble Ideas. Okay, so that's the card from Saturday. Okay, so let's look at the card from Sunday. Okay, let's see what the card says for Sunday. Okay, so let's see what the card says for Sunday. Okay, so let's see what the card says for Sunday. Okay, so let's see what the card says for Sunday. Okay, so let's see what the card says for Sunday. Okay, so let's see what the card says for Sunday. Okay, so let's see what the card says for Sunday. Okay, so let's see what the card says for Sunday. To seek the guide with noble ideals. To seek somebody who's going to guide you because they want to help you, because they want you to go the right way. Not people who just do it for their own agenda. Okay, and for the final day Sunday, this card is coming to me. And it's explore other realms. So in other realms I can you know, explore um, astral, in astral traveling, you can explore other realms, in meditation, um, you can do fairy visitation. So just explore other realms and let yourself dream. Dream is a great way to explore other realms. We have a half life reading. That's a way to explore other realms. But it's good for you to let your mind go and explore these other places in the world that sometimes we're afraid of and we don't know how to explore and there's nothing to be afraid of. Okay, well, I hope you have a lovely week, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.